Ushahidi is the Swahili word for witness or testimony. Ushahidi, the software, allows for people to share their story. Our mantra revolves around three things, the crowd, uh, verification, and response. Ushahidi is free and open source. Anybody can go to the web and download it and run their own platform tomorrow. It's that simple. It allows a citizen to report to indicate, hey, this is what's going on. The underlying thing is they can use whichever device they have in their pocket. And all that information is brought into a central location and mapped, so what we call geolocation. The big mission that we're on, it's really to change the way information flows in the world, to give ordinary people a voice. Ushahidi came about after the post-election violence in Kenya in early 2008. The election went south. The media houses were shut down. During that time, we started to see reports of violence come in on our blogs. That very first week is when we built out this, this platform. It's this mashup of information coming from ordinary citizens, news reports, and we, we just plotted them on a map. We just did what we could. We, we could do something. We didn't realize it would have this much of an impact. Now, Ushahidi is available in more than 30 languages, in more than 159 countries. There have been over 30,000 deployments of Ushahidi around the world. Major impact in places like Haiti, Japan, Pakistan, uh, Libya, you, you know, it's all over the world now. One of the projects that we're working on in Kenya is that of the election. Since our entire existence is out of the previous election in Kenya, we feel like it is our duty this time to be completely prepared for it. Today we have a really big meeting of people coming in to help us create this platform. It's not just us, it is for everyone, uh, by everyone. It's really about a free, fair, open Kenya elections and using Ushahidi's technology and knowledge about how to do crowdsourcing in order to make it so. What technology does is give everyone a voice that was not there before. In a sense, it democratizes information. And then, done the right way, it makes things a little more transparent. The MacArthur Award will help this institution leverage technology in the service of citizens. I think there's no better feeling of gratification that one can have than taking something that you hope can change the world and seeing it happen.